Adjustment layers. Probably the most important thing to learn in Photoshop. Probably where I spend 90% of my time when editing photos. Here's what they are, and here's how I use them. Got to jump into Photoshop here. Adjustment layers are right here, bottom right. That little button is where all the magic happens. I encourage you guys to go through and play with these different layers, adjust sliders, get a feel for how they affect your image. And you'll start using these all the time in Photoshop if you are not already. Um, so I'm just gonna show you some quick examples of how I play with adjustment layers to edit my photograph. One of my favorite ones is curves. Obviously, you can use it to affect your shadows and highlights. And all of this is just personal preference. Another one I really love is color balance, essentially altering your white balance on your photograph a little bit, or you can really shift the colors and start color correcting or setting your color tones for your image. Love levels. Levels is another one for shadows and highlights. People can use them for colors as well. I just use them for shadows and highlights. And another one that I love to use is hue saturation. And I just jump on whatever colors I want to adjust or you can just adjust the master. And now let me show you a couple of things that I do with these adjustment layers. I will sometimes just adjust the opacity opacity of the specific layer or you can jump on a mask and start painting the, the adjustments on where you want them on your photograph in this case I don't want them on the whole photograph so I'm going to invert the mask with command I and I'm going to jump on that mask and I don't know we'll just bump her up a little bit with saturation so I'm just painting it on where I want it and that's that and then another really great adjustment layer selective color. It's one of those things where you just play with each of the colors, adjust the sliders, and see how it affects your image, and that's it. That's adjustment layers, guys. You can mask them, you can adjust your opacity, you can group the whole thing and see the before and after, and you can even mask your whole group and take it off if it's too much with a brush, or you can put it back on if you want, or you can take the whole group and just adjust the opacity, opacity, I don't know how to pronounce that word, but that's it. That's adjustment layers, guys, and that's how I use them to edit my photos. Bye-bye.